Hi everyone, this is Asma Khali from Cloud Pages, and in today's video, we are going to check out all the new features that are mentioned in the brand new Cloud Pages V2, and uh, that is a newer version of Cloud Pages with a newer design with a much much more accessibility and much less clicks, and everything is going to be super cool. We have new features, we have redefined the older features and I hope you really really like it so in this video I'm going to show you some of the things that uh, have already been done and some of the things that will be done pretty soon so stay tuned with us and let's check out this video okay guys so to get to v2 all you have to do is come on to your platform dot cloud pages dot cloud and click on cloud pages v2 beta at the top and you will enter the v2 version all right so basically with this version everything is much more accessible it is reducing the number of clicks it is basically reducing the layers that were present in v1 and everything is right in front of you everything is super accessible and right uh, in front of you for you uh, for your work instead of v1 in which you needed to go into projects and then servers and then managers so everything is right in front of you basically all right, so I'm just going to show you a couple of things that are happening with V1. Number one, that you can check out your sites. Uh, it is simple. All you have to do is click on application and click on WordPress. So you are going to see all of your WordPress sites that you're working with and in which servers they're working with, their IPs. It's super simple. But with V1, uh, previously you needed to go into your projects and then your server and then your WordPress manager. So what it's doing is it's reducing this loading time and it's reducing this, uh, the number of clicks basically. So we are removing the layers and it's right in front of you. Next, you can create your own site from the home page. So right from the home page, you have the option of create a new website, just select your server and select your WordPress application, your, your PHP application. Now, before you only had the options of WordPress and PHP, but with V2, you also have the option of Motic and PHP My Admin. These were added in V2. They are very highly requested features and they're very functional. Okay, next, you can deploy a server from the home page. So it's super simple. Simply click on servers and click on add new server and you will be able to deploy your uh, server super easily it's like right in front of you and basically basically it's what it's doing it's it's opening up for your accessibility for your ease so it's super simple to deploy a server using v2 next you can uh, access any server from the same page i just showed you that it's right in front of you uh, you don't have so all of your servers will be showed over here in every project you don't have to move to uh, some other project for example in the previous version if you needed let me just go back to dashboard if you needed to check out your servers in new project you needed to go come back to this home page and then open up new project or you uh, if you needed to access uh, a server in pro import uh, important you need to come back to pro important uh, to the home page and then click over here and then check out your servers but with v2 it's everything is right in front of you it will be shown in front of you your name will be mentioned over here and everything is going to be right in front of you all right so the next really cool feature that we are launching, it's not launched yet, but it's coming soon. That is Cloudflare DNS Sync. So it's still in working, it's still coming. I know a lot of people ask for it and it's still in the pipeline. All right, next, uh, you can move your site to some other server. For example, if you want your site to be moved to some other server, it was not previously offered feature with V1, but now with V2, you can do that. All you have to do is click on application, click on uh, um, WordPress click on your site and you will be able to see this little tab over here but previously it was not over here when you click on that tab you will be able to see all of your servers over here for example right now it's in IP IP but if I had more servers deployed within my project I could move it to some other uh, server so it's this is a new feature that we have just launched also, let me just go back to my home really quickly. 
uh, with v2 you can define your own set of plugins so what you can do is uh, with v2 all you have to do is click go into your settings and you can add your new plugin bucket so you can basically add your new set of um, plugins so that is a really cool feature that we just introduced with v2 and there are a lot of more features that are coming soon and they are in the work and in, in the future i'm going to share them with you so just stay tuned with us and i hope you like all the changes that we are doing just for you and do check them out in your uh, in your basically dashboard just go over there explore a little and i hope you like them and that's it for today i hope the video was really useful if you still have any questions just drop a comment in the comment section and don't forget to like and subscribe cloud pages